that's called the egomaniac fool. Yeah! <laughs> Stay tuned. Well, my friends, this is Bobby D coming to you from Tolomba, Cebu, Philippines. I'm having an awesome time in the Philippines today. Hope you are as well, wherever you're from. Hey, today, I want to talk to you about what kind of fool you are in the Philippines. What kind of fool are you in the Philippines? Yeah. <laughs> What a joy, such a joy to come back to you again, my friends. And today, I want to say for those of you that are here for the first time, you can click on your subscribe button and the bell notification icon. So you continue seeing fresh Philippine videos, motivational videos, and the worldwide videos. Now, when you talk about the Philippines, you're saying this is the country where everybody is dating and everybody falls in love sooner or later. Now, the problem is, sometimes there are people that are fools. Yeah, there's three times fools that date in the Philippines. And I'm going to name them out for you. First of all, there is the educated fool. Uh -huh. Yeah, educated fool. <laughs> Woo, yeah, that's the kind of guy. He goes around thinking he knows it all. Yeah. But when he hooks up on a Filipina, he winds up being scammed. Bam, thank you, ma'am. Yeah. <laughs> Educated fool. Got all kind of degrees. Got a master, got a BS, got a doctor degree. But he don't have a degree in Filipina. <laughs> Woo. Educated fool. And now, the problem with the educated fool, they never can figure out the Philippines because they think they know it all. So they wind up being scam, bam, thank you, ma'am. For every penny, every peso they got. The educated fool, yeah, that's the first one. Now, there's another kind of fool that comes around here in the Philippines trying to date the Philippines. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know what I'm talking about. That's the economic fool. Uh-huh, yeah, that's the kind of guy and he think he's a rich man. He got everything in the pocket. And he say, nobody can get my money. But guess what, guy? The economic fool had not met a Philippine. <laughs> when he talks to the Filipino, he opens up his wallet and sends it everything. <laughs> Woo, that's the economic fool. Uh -huh. Thinks he, he want to keep track of every penny. He want to keep track of every peso, every dime, every dollar. And then he turns around and meets the Filipina. They make him shout, make him holler. <laughs> Woo, and they send him every penny. They send the Filipina every peso, every dime, every dollar they got. Yeah, that's the economic fool. Now there's another kind of fool to go around here trying to date these Filipinos with no understanding. That's called the egomaniac fool. Yeah! <laughs> that's the guy. He always want to be stroked. He always want somebody to stroke him because he want to be lifted up. He want to be filled. He, all, he can't get enough of himself. He's called the egomaniac fool. And so the Filipino strokes and tells him everything he want to hear. Oh, you look so good today. You are so handsome. And then next thing you know, you get all this money sent to the Philippines. That's the egomaniac fool. Uh-huh. Yeah. I'm telling you guys, you got to be careful. You don't want to be a fool for a Philippine. Question for the day. What kind of fool have you been in the Philippines? Leave your comments for me, the comment section of this video. And as always, remember to like, share, and subscribe. This is Bobby D. Take care. God bless. And peace.